Lacrimal Apparatus Introduction The structures concerned with the secretion and drainage of lacrimal tear fluid together form the lacrimal apparatus. The lacrimal apparatus consists of the following structures. Lacrimal gland, ducts of the lacrimal gland, conjunctival sac, lacrimal puncta, lacrimal canaliculi, lacrimal sac, nasal lacrimal duct, lacrimal gland. It's a J-shaped serous gland. It consists of the upper large orbital part and lower small palpable part. The two parts are continuous with each other around the lateral margin of the levator palpebrae superioris. The orbital part is almond-shaped and situated in the lacrimal fossa. The palpable part is one-third of the size of the orbital part and is situated in the lateral part of the upper eyelid below the levator palpebrae superioris muscle. Ducts of the lacrimal gland The ducts of the lacrimal gland are approximately 12 in number, about 4 or 5 from the orbital part, and 6 to 8 from the palpable part. They open into the lateral parts of the superior fornix of the conjunctival sac. Lacrimal gland secretes the lacrimal tear fluid and its ducts convey it to the conjunctival sac. About one milliliter of lacrimal fluid is secreted per day. Half of it evaporates and the remaining half is drained into the lacrimal sac. Functions of lacrimal fluid Flushes the conjunctiva and keeps the cornea moist. Provides nourishment to the cornea. Serves to express emotions, shedding tears during grief and sorrow. Prevents infection, for it contains bactericidal lysozyme. Pathway of Tears Tears are produced in the lacrimal gland, below the lateral eyebrow. Go to lacrimal ducts. Reach the superior conjunctival fornix. Reach the anterior eyeball and then to the lacus lacrimalis, and then go to lacrimal canaliculi at the inner canthus, then enters the lacrimal sac, and then to nasal lacrimal duct, which then drains the tears into the inferior nasal metus. Arterial supply, lacrimal branch of the ophthalmic artery. Venous drainage is by ophthalmic veins. Nerve supply of lacrimal gland. Parasympathetic secretomotor supply of the lacrimal gland. The preganglionic parasympathetic fibers arise from the lacrimatory nucleus in the pons and pass successfully through nervous intermedius, reaches geniculate ganglion, greater petrosal nerve, and to the nerve of the pterygoid canal to reach the pterygopalatine ganglion where they relay. The postganglionic fibers arise from the cells of the pterygopalatine ganglion, pass successfully through the maxillary nerve, reach the zygomatic nerve, zygomaticotemporal nerve, and lacrimal nerve to reach the lacrimal gland. Sensory innervation of lacrimal gland is via lacrimal nerve, a branch of ophthalmic nerve. That's all for the video. We'll see you next time.